In today's video, we're opening $4,000 of vintage magic product. What's up guys, quick intro before we hop into it because this is a really awesome video that I have finally gotten out because you know, Magic the Gathering, not normally what we do here, but when Rich from Magic to Millions was here, well not here, at my old place, we opened a bunch of vintage Magic like antiquities, legends, we opened a revised starter, which by the way, I've already posted that one, so go check out that video if you have not seen it yet. Uh, it was pretty awesome, we had some pretty good pulls, and in this video we opened 4,000 more dollars worth of stuff. There are some pretty good pulls as well. So if you are a Magic fan and you're not used to you know, my channel, that's okay. Just sit back, relax and enjoy this one. Probably not gonna be happening too often because Rich isn't gonna come every, every week with his $5,000 in product open, but it was super fun. So I wanted you guys to see it. We're also doing a quick giveaway, $50. I'll be giving away one of you guys. I don't really have a lot of magic stuff laying around and I wanted it, if you like magic, maybe you could win the giveaway and get your own magic cards, et cetera. So just like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications, let me know down below. What's your favorite pack that we opened in this video and what is your favorite pull? All right, Roxon, so, uh... I brought something a little special for you. I know you'd like doing those old school box openings for uh, Yu-Gi-Oh. Okay. So I brought you something old school and magic to open up. Oh my goodness. We're looking at 1998, huh? It's a uh, Silver Ages somewhere in there. So yeah, it's a uh, it's a uh, pretty pretty old. This box. is before any TCG Yu-Gi-Oh. So we're we're yeah. looking real old. And these are like what? 60 pack boxes? These are 36. 36. Okay. Yeah, I think the date is on it somewhere. I don't remember where. This on the is bottom. crazy. Still sealed too. Yeah. What is this? Two dollars. What does that say? Two forty-five a pack. <laughs> Two dollars and forty-five cents. <laughs> hey, I, I'd like to buy this from you. Yeah, me, yeah, me too. I'll buy hundred. Two forty-five. I'm pack. down. <laughs> okay. They've got the they've got the price on printed on the box. That's kind of yep. insane. That's how old this is. They yep. actually printed that's the price the, on that's there. The old school magic right there. They had the box prices printed wow. and like everything, right? That's beautiful. Right, okay. I think there's even some stuff in the bottom of the box too, like dates and other things like oh, okay. that. Okay. There might be there. Yeah, there you oh, go. Yeah, let's flip this over like this. There's, this there's your heavy. OG, OG barcodes and everything else. Wow. Yeah. Okay, I really don't want to like hit the box either, so I'm trying to be precision. There we go. Yeah, like that. Nice. Nice and gentle with the wrap. You don't want to destroy anything if you don't have to. 45 packs of greatness or whatever it is. I don't know. There's no one. There's no resealing this anymore. All right. No more resealing. That's good. We don't want to do that. Get this out. You got those like heebie jeebies like that. That feels good. You're like, oh, yeah. oh, oh. We, did it. we did it. I just destroyed something I should not have opened. Do you bend this normally or not? You just leave it. To, yeah. I don't want to ruin this box for you. So maybe we'll go like this. Yeah, it's like it's like nat it naturally creases right there. Yeah, so. just kind of crease a little bit like that. Pop open. OK, look at those packs. Those are yeah. beautiful, man. Those there are insane. Should be, there should be a date on the back of these somewhere. That looks incredible. Probably. I really like the silver. What do you say? Silver age is what yeah. these are called. I really like the pack look on these. They look incredible. All right. So we're going to open one of each here. Yeah, let's do this. OK, I guess I'll start unless you want to. No, this is all you. And okay. I've actually never opened alliances. I think it's the same orientation. So it's the back four. I don't know if this is going to. OK, wait, I'm going to I'm going to be really careful. Let's like go this. for it. It's OK, okay wait, we're going to be we're going to be really gentle here. Yeah, the, the reason why we do it from the back is just because it's easier and you're less prone. Yeah. But you oh, can do it from the okay. top as well if you're careful. You just have to be, yeah. you just okay. always have to be careful. Similar like how, like LOBI, I assume, and stuff like that. Yeah, too, exactly. So. You don't want to. I always get scared not opening it too far because you don't want to hit the corner. So I'm going to, I'm just going to go down the middle now, like this. So we don't have any corner damage on the way out. Like that. Okay, you said it's four again. It might be, it might only be three because there's 12 cards here. Oh, uh, well, if it's no. four, it'll be fine either way because it'll be a common, right? Yeah, so yeah, it'll it work. Be. We might end with a common, but if we do, we do. Okay, we have Gorilla War Cry. These feel like newer, even though yeah. they're like a couple, only a couple years. Mm -hmm. We have the Gorilla Chieftain. They just feel like more quality. Oh, that guard is so off center. Look at the forehead. <laughs> oh my gosh. Is that, the, what's that like a 6.5 centering grade or something? Oh, probably worse. Yeah, that's that's pretty bad. That's, we like, have, a, that's like an 80, 20 centering. <laughs> wow, that is, that's pretty nice. Soul to be Adenate. We have the Veteran's Voice. Oh man, this whole pack is foreheaded. Oh, yeah, no. no, this is rough. It's rough. Oh, okay, there oh, we go. We're getting back to might be... okay, maybe a better print sheet, I guess. Yeah. OK, I thought you were saying this is the rare. I was like, oh, well, no, I don't know, because usually if the centering changes that much, it might be. We'll have to look these up and see, because I really don't remember what this. What the... Yeah. Oh, no, we're back to it. That could have been the rare then. Maybe, okay. Or maybe it's an uncommon. Yeah, we'll Who set, knows we'll what we'll set we'll up the side and look it up real quick. We'll figure it out. We have the Wild Ash Star, Aster. Suburbs. We've got the Hereti. I can't read these cards. We have the <laughs> Reprised. Right. Uh, there we go, Reprised all, okay. Sears of the Veteran. For some reason, the L's, I always think they're D's on this. Yeah. Sears of the Veteran. 
We have the contagion. contagion. Oh no, yeah. don't bring that up. Come on. <laughs> Prediction. Oh, is this it? Urza's engine. Okay. That's it. That's it. That's a rare. That's our rare. Okay, Urza's engine. Always good to get an Urza card, right? Oh yep. man, look at that. Yeah, that's break. <laughs> yeah. Oh no. Four corner. Unfortunate. Well, nice card. I mean, nice card. I don't yeah, know. I think I have this in a BGS ten. Oh, okay. Yeah. I've been, let's see. We did four, right? Yeah, four. Boom. And it was right. It seemed. Yeah, there might be the uncommons. There might only be two uncommons or something in here. I don't know. We'll have to look up look up what that is afterwards here. Cause we've got one more of these we're doing. Eldoran escort. Our center's a lot better here actually. Ooh. Like a lot better. Yeah, I mean it's hard to be worse than whatever that was last time. Hopefully the whole box is better. Yeah, right. Foresight. Okay. Elvish Ranger. Platinum's Legacy. Okay. Moldovian Warmakers. Noble Steeds. Noble Steeds. Gotta ride the horses. Reprisal, we saw yeah, that one 10 yeah, seconds A couple ago. times, yeah. No, oh, stop it! <laughs> Not again! The plague. The plague. Oh my gosh. Scarab of the Unseen. And we have our rare. Oh, we got Gorilla. <laughs> Another we Gorilla. Gorilla. Gorilla is back. The monkey. We've been mankied. More. Oh no. More Pokemon. Not bad. Not bad. We'll take that though. All right. Solid, so, solid. All right. We're back. With alliances. Hunting for gold. We found out that there's not a rare in every pack necessarily, <laughs> so. We, we were slightly confused, so yeah. we, we, we did some research real quick. Yeah, three we, uncommon. Sometimes an uncommon is in the rare slot. Yeah. Seems like that happened on the second pack last time, but that's fine. This time though. Now we know, we know. But at least we know our little pack trick was pretty good, so. You know, we did the right trick. The problem was there was just no rare. Yeah, <laughs> there them. was just no rare in that. You can't time. really do it right when there's no rare, okay. And there may still be, I don't know. We're gonna have to look them up. I'll look all this stuff up individually after we're done here. Yeah, we did. We're trying to figure it out, but this seems a little bit different than the other ones. There's like 33,000 magic cards or something like that, I think now, like unique ones. So 33,000. Uh, yeah, there's some crazy it's even more than like Yu-Gi-Oh. Right. And uh, I unfortunately do not know them all. Well, probably fortunately. You don't know them all. Come on, man. <laughs> Step it up, dude. Slacking over here. All right. I'm going to do four. Just yeah, it kind of worked. So yeah. we're going to do four. All right, Storm Shaman, give us something crazy here. We got the Bestial I'd, Fury. I'd, I'd love to see a Force of Will. That's like one of the most iconic cards in Magic. I would love like, to do that. That'd be great. We have the Royal Herbalist. Phyrexian War Beast. War Beast, okay. very nice. Swamp Mosquito. Oh, that, That's no thank you. Big Arse Mosquito. Yeah, no thank you. I'll pass. We have Dude, the Gorilla Berserkers. Thing, like, stuck in your arm I think or... I might die <laughs> if that happens. You're just shrivel up. I don't think I would last. Uh, we have the Viscard Armor. Stormcrow. Storm this is the most OP card in Magic. Why? Because it's a meme. There was a... Where so, you, what is even like the effect here? Is there no so, effect? It's just flying no, and then it's so, a one, two? So for Force of Will, you have to pitch a blue card with like... There's like some stipulation with Force of Will. You have to pitch a blue if I remember correctly. So the joke was, is when they were spoiling the set, the dev or whoever was doing the spoiling was like, Stormcrow is such a good card. You can pitch it for Force of Will. So, so this is the most OP card in Magic. <laughs> Pitch it as in like discard it. Yeah, you just—it's so it. good you can just discard it. Wow, that that's so, pretty amazing. So it's like so this card's like an ultimate, yeah. like it's ultra meme. -y cause ultra like, meme. Um, that's and like, hilarious. And like graded, this sells for like crazy money. Which okay, is look, hysterical. this is just a sign that we're gonna get a force of will, right? Because it fits perfectly. It's true. It's true. All right, feast or famine. We're about nice. to feast, baby. Let's go. Spiny starfish. Spiny star Sure. Watch out. He gonna pluck you. We got the pyrokinesis. That's pretty cool. Here it is. Because it could be an uncommon in the rare slot. Mm -hmm. Ooh, Keeper of Tressahorn. Tressahorn. All right. Not bad. Go ahead and sleeve that one sleeve up. it up. Nice and protect. It's a 6-6. Six, six. Isn't that like gigantic? It is. That's gigantic for vintage. They call those bombs. Yeah. He's, a, he's a large man. All right. I'm going to say, look, Force of Will will be pulled in this pack. Because yep. it'll go I'm with gonna, the crow I'm guy. Dig. I'm gonna dig a little bit. Oh, you're getting a little aggressive. I thought gonna, about doing this, and I was just like, no. Nah, we're gonna, we're gonna dig. We might, we might do one more so you can dig if you want to. But oh, look at the, oh, look at that, lighting it on fire. <laughs> oh my goodness. He's lighting it on fire. Here it comes. Oh, there it goes. No, it's over. It, it party fouled. Those four right there. Storm Shannon for our first common that we get. Let's go. The pigeons. Let's go. Fear the pigeons. Stench of decay. Dude, I've never seen pigeons as bold as the ones in New York City, man. They're crazy. I'll just walk right up never here and pluck food. Really? Yep. Interesting. You should go sometime. Kind of a long way away. It's not that far. Yeah, not that far. It's true. It's a, it's a quick flight. Okay. 
by Rexian Warbeast. He's back. Our Warbeast has returned. Ooh, school. School. This is a land. I'm probably just going to go ahead and sleeve this because the lands are actually worth... Actually, I'll pass this off to you to sleeve. Yep. Hand it over. I got it. Usually usually lands are worth some, some decent oh, money. stupid sleeve. There we go. And... Oh! That's how we do it! <laughs> Oh. I told you! Oh, I told you! It grows with the cut! We need something to pitch! Oh. We got the crow already! It's incredible! Oh, this is a double rare pack! Oh my gosh. And Phyrexian Devourer! Okay, I gotta... Oh my god! Oh, let's go! Talk about an epic oh, pack right dude, there! What, dude, what? That oh is crazy! The condition actually looks pretty clean on this thing too! Okay, maybe the cat corner's not great, but... Oh, yeah, centering. Okay, I take it back. I take it back. Still oh, a beautiful card. Oh, God. That's insane. Oh, what a hit. Dude, that's the oh, card. That's the card. That's it's the like, card. This and Lake of the Dead are the most expensive cards, but like Force of Will is just like crazy. All right, wait. Let's, let's get the ultimate combo together. Come on. Oh, oh true, true. Dynamic duo. <laughs> All right, let's go. The most OP card. Did you guys hear about how good it is? <laughs> Here it is. <laughs> I just had a feeling we pulled that crow and told me that story. I was oh, like, it's just dude. meant to be right now. And you oh, dug for this too. I did. I, that was a random. You just the plucked of that thing out of dude, there. I'm a wizard. I'm a wizard, Harry. <laughs> that is, that's insane. Oh my, we got some pretty good luck okay. today. That was, that was good. Oh that's my God. That's nice. Magic the Gathering, yep. the Wrath Cycle, Stronghold, 15 yep. tradable game cards. If 2002, the beginning of Yu-Gi-Oh! TCG. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Okay. We're going, we're going full circle here. Yeah, this is beautiful. Mox Diamond. This is going to happen, okay? Dude, if you pull a Mox Diamond, I'm going to freak. Because like, that's like a $600 <laughs> card for all of us. Yeah, that would be insano let's yeah, see if we can do that that's, though that would be pretty cool. i'm down i'm down for that look at that side. opening yeah. oh my goodness i'm getting good at this he's learning he's learning the ways these i think are a little bit easier too with these crimps yeah a little bit easier all right that's how you do it keep that pack artwork nice and no spoiler in it now so yeah then it's the the four yep and then this this is your rare okay so. perfect we're just gonna we got we got our commons here brush with death beautiful Contempt. Nice blue card. That, it just gives me Star Wars vibes. Right. I like it. That's really cool. Cannibalize. Watch out. Sky Shroud Falcon. Verb. Not to be confused with Stormcrow. Yeah, no. P card and magic. Yeah, that, we, <laughs> birds have brought us good luck so far. I mean, they have. So. The birds have been, the birds yeah. have been good. The, the birds, birds have been good. They've been very good. Dungeon Shade. We got the Bandage. Watch out. Tidal Surge. Nice, nice. All right. Mog Flunkies. Let me know if any of these commons are good because... Nah, most of the commons are 10, 20 cents. Like okay. Yeah, they're, okay. they're nothing crazy. Lowland Basilisk, that's interesting. He looks more like a frog to me. Right? He's got like a frog and a lizard vibes, like he mixed does, together. He does have the lizard man vibes. Yeah, that's an interesting combo Watch there. out for lizard people, 2024 guys. They're going to leave the world. <laughs> yeah, take over. Seething <laughs> Angers, this guy, oh, he's got a nice sword. Watch mm -hmm. out. Every Change time, of heart! Yeah, every time I see this card, I think Sliver Queen, because, like, it literally has this Sliver Queen on it. It's just, like, a huge common bait. I'm just like, ah. This is Yu-Gi-Oh! printed a Change of Heart in 2002 as well. It's a, it's oh, really? A, it's a year of Change of Heart. Okay. Uh, we also had Magic Rulers, so and that didn't go over so well. Rage is our, our uncommon here. I'll go okay. ahead and Yeah, you want to save all of these. So. Bull Whip is not bad. It's Bull Whip, beautiful. Blocks. Okay, we got one more. Dothy Trop for Trapper. That's actually okay. not bad either. Very solid. It's a 1-1. One, one. All right, so we got this is the moment here. You ready, you ready for the Mox Diamond? I'm ready for the Mox here Diamond. Here it comes. Let's see it. Okay, maybe not. Maybe okay. not. Maybe okay. next time. Maybe maybe you'll get it. We'll rest shapeshifter. It's okay. Okay, not bad. Not, not bad. Not the world's worst, but also we're not going crazy or anything. Yeah, but <laughs> not, not nuts about. And uh, I can't open Stronghold to save my life, so you can go ahead and open that one too. Okay. All right. I got you. I legitimately can't pull anything. We shot okay. the uh, we shot a video at Rudy when we were with Rudy last this past weekend. And, okay. Uh, that's like the only time I've pulled anything remotely decent out of Stronghold. I think it was still like. <laughs> we said it was like 50 bucks a card. It was probably like $25 worth of cards yeah. that we pulled. Like, it was just abysmal. Like It I just cannot... wasn't terrible, yeah. so you're like, thank goodness, I actually got something. Like, I opened more more than Saint, though, for like the first time ever, which is just crazy. Okay, let me do that very carefully. All right, we have the Hammerhead Shark. Watch out for that guy. Smacking him with the teeth. The, the Craven cool. Giant. Torment. There's your Minotaur. Yeah, okay, wrong. <laughs> not that guy. I'll, I'll find him later. One. We have the uh, Furnace Spirit, the Endangered Armodon, Spirit Encore. Was that Encore? I don't know. Yeah, Encore. Probably Encore. Okay, Tidal Surge. 
Crossbow ambush. The tortured existence. Man, that that the the like black border ones look really cool. Yeah. Alright. We got the Cloud Spirit. Walking Dream. I think that's is that the uncommon? I think it yeah. is, yeah. Okay, walking dream. We got a hey, there we go. silver. That's, that's a few bucks. That's a few bucks. That's a nice card. All right. That's a good hit. That's a good hit. One we more take that. uncommon. Rebound. Rebound. Also a decent one. Play a little basketball. And, and here we, we go. Slow, are we slow rolling it? We're slow rolling right it. Right here, right here. Here it comes. Okay. Uh, it didn't. It we're wasn't. Gonna, we're gonna grind a corner on that one. Yeah. Okay. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Maybe, maybe not the mox diamond this time. I, I think. Feel like, I think the sliver was worth more. I think we were. I think we were due for <laughs> not okay. such a crazy pull right there. I was looking at the the price guide of the stuff, and there are so many crazy, crazy cards right? in here. I'm nervous because this is like nine hundred dollar packs. You know, we're talking like <laughs> like this is like a Legend Blue Eyes first edition pack in the same like price range. Yep. And it's, you know, not even like the first set. So that's just yep. insane. So we're doing one pack of legends and I have been lucky. I've been blessed enough to be allowed to open this thing. So I'm going to be very careful. Oh my goodness. This is going to be intense. If we can pull anything crazy, it would be awesome. Yeah. And the way the correlation on this one is you have your rule card in the back. So just when you're opening them, just be careful. So we don't spoil it. We don't spoil the rare. Yeah. we got to be really careful because there's a rare right behind this rule card, which yeah. is nice that the rule card's there. So you you can actually open it without getting spoiled. Yep. Okay, I'm gonna be... You have to be a little more careful with antiquities because the rare and the uncommons in the back, but and it's the same yeah. thing, but... And dark was the same way too. It was the two uncommon slash rares were in the back of the pack like okay, that. Don't so. spoil it, don't spoil it. Oh no, there's a little There's a little edge right there. There we go, <laughs> yeah, okay. Boom. All right, we Look got it. that, gorgeous. Well, well done, okay. I'm just gonna, to play it safe, we're gonna flip them because yeah, we're gonna do it this way. So we're gonna go first card. And... We have the Amaru, Amaru Kithkin. Very nice. Okay, so there's only eight cards in this set. So I think well, there's 15 in this pack. Oh, 15. So no, eight cards in the other set. Okay. I was yeah. like, this feels like more than eight. Okay, so there's, is there three rares or there's three 11, uncommons? 11 commons, three uncommons, one rare. Okay. And our, our big hits, there's, and Chain Lightning is a really big common hit, and the centering actually mm -hmm. looks really nice on these. Like these you know, yeah. Where's that? Where's that creators. sleeve? I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this and make this easier. Let's, let's put this down right here, and then I'm gonna do one at a time, so I can really be careful with these. Okay, that's a pretty sick looking card. The champ. These are kind. Of, the text is a little bit hard to read on these. It is a little finicky sometimes yeah. on these. They're a little bit difficult. But like yeah. this was, this was like OG Watsy era. Yeah. They we're still figuring stuff out and hit Scorpion. That that one's a little easier because the black background right there. Mm -hmm. This is back in the time when the digital art was not a thing. Um, a lot of these OG paintings actually sell for like 10, 20, 30, 50, wow. 100,000 plus dollars because they're all hand painted by the artists. That's so cool. Like it's, and I'm sure like the OG Yu-Gi-Oh stuff was probably somewhat like that too even. It's a little, little bit on the back of this corner, unfortunately. Equinox. It's yeah. a cool looking card. Legends of Antiquities was pretty notorious for like fisheye print dots and rolled corners yeah. and stuff. That's why the, the graded premiums on these cards are just so crazy. Wall of Vapor. Pretty cool. Like uh, Chain Lightning is one of... Uh, Chain Lightning and Darkness are the two big commons in here. Um, yeah. And... Hey! <laughs> Speak of the devil! This Darkness! Card, this card raw, I think, is like... They've, Teen or twenty dollars, but like if this grades out to like a nine five from BGS, it's like closer to a hundred, and then like a Ooh. nine five quad is in like the hundreds. That's really awesome. Like there, there's like really crazy premiums on some of these cards. Wall and like of Chain heat. Lightning is like the same way, and that's like I think Chain Lightning is like twenty or twenty five for a common. Oh! <laughs> How about both of them? Let's go! What a pack! Speaking of the devil, we oh pulled my both. God. That is insane. Okay. All right, dude. Uh, this is a good sign for this wow. pack. This is a great start. That's literally the best two, two cards, cards you can pull. Look at this. Like, literally the best two cards. Like there, those. That's like you're holding like forty dollars in cards right there. Almost. That's solid, and that's just the it just commons. Like, just the commons. So obviously we're not making our money back yet, but that's still really nice. Yeah, you can see the corners. A lot of mm -hmm. them are like that. Spirit Shackle, very cool. All right. It's gonna be funny when you when I see the edits for these after you're done with them, and they're like the little price thing starts ticking <laughs> yeah. down on them from the TCG low and stuff. I'm gonna laugh so it's hard. Gonna be, it's gonna be great. <laughs> they're gonna man. be like permanent red, but I'm like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's the problem. Like when, when people just watch and they see like they're like, but you lost money. It's like, well, nah, you know, there, there's price. other things that are involved, I think but we're in the uncommon here. Yeah, yeah. Marble Priest. Yeah, okay, so, oh, that might have been, oh, There's we have one, one more, like one, one more. more. So okay. we're looking for a mana drain here. Let's see if we can do a mana drain. Man, this would be, would be a great pack. 
Ooh, ooh, that's a sick hit. Teleri is nice. Yeah. There, there's Let's the community go. college right there, right? So Teleri is one of the better, one of the better uncommon lands in the set. I think Teleri wow. is, it was upwards of like 100, I think at one point, but I don't think it's up there This anymore. is an insane pack right now. Yeah, no, this is insane. Now, if this rare is crazy, I'm, I'm this leaving. might be like the best pack of all time. <laughs> I'm leaving. Right? What, what is this? Is this Tabernacle pack? Oh, dude. $2,800? Oh, uh, okay. It's All right, like Rudy, boat. send us some luck. All right, here we go. Oh, let's, let's four horsemen, four horsemen. Come on, baby, anything. I see some stuff on the edges, but... Oh. Okay, Gus the Dirk's not bad. I don't know this guy, so I'm assuming he's it's, not crazy. It's, it's nothing crazy. It's still, it's I still mean, pretty decent. Like, I think it's like 70, 80 bucks for a near mint copy. For oh, that. wow. So it's not, it's not bad. I like, mean, with everything pretty... else, that turns out to be okay. Oh, yeah. You know, and, you know we'll, depending we'll... on how your grading goes and everything. Do you, sleep, do you keep these? Yeah, they're like three or four dollars. These are three or four dollars? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that makes sense. I mean, right. I would hang on to it too. <laughs> All right. We're back. I'm pumped. That last hack oh, was insane. We've had some crazy back. luck Great. today. That was good. Like, that was a good legend. The problem is there's a rare right at the back. So we're going to try not to spoil it and also open it without damaging the card. So it's an interesting dynamic we have it here. Is, it is a little little interesting on the dynamic. So I'm going to take I'm going to be very careful with this antiquities pack. This is an eight card pack, so it's not like the craziest in terms of numbers of cards, but the quantity will be over the quality here. Yeah, and uh -oh. the, the quality on these two is crazy. Like the uh, the Tron lands are all 20 30 40 50 bucks like the factories are all worth 50 60 70 bucks like and there's uh there's actually some of the lands and stuff are actually slotted into the commons like the different strip um, and stuff like that so like it's uh there's there's some fire in here there's some okay. straight fire in here okay i'm just gonna do like this it's we're gonna go one opening. at a time no no spoilering we have the millstone, millstone. very nice decent Okay, are there crazy commons we're looking for in this? It's pretty much the Tron lands. Tron All lands. The, a lot okay. of the lands are in the common slots. Okay, we have the Poltergeist. Pretty cool, the, but... The, the OG troll. He is not a land, I will say that. Okay, that one we have a little little corner thing going on. All right, the Pixies. The pixies. Okay. Nice. I think this is reserve list. I don't remember. Okay, next Too many cards. card. We have Amulet of Krog. Krug? Krug, Amulet of Krug, all right. Are we down to, it's the last three, right? Yeah, the last two cards. So we have two more commons and then we have our uncommon slash two cards. Rares. Okay, okay, only two total, okay. Nice, Dragon Engine, that's a good common. To that do. looks like a cool card. If this grades well, it's worth a pretty penny. Okay, good. that's that good. Looks like a decent one, great. And that's our last common, so artifact board. Oh, does this one look, I thought it looked bent for some a second. Of, some of them came out of the, the back a little bit like that. A little bit of in the sleeve and stuff. A little bit of like a uh, warpy out, yeah. thing going on. The nice yeah. part is with it's no hollows, there's not as much like yeah, warping it's, it's that happens. It's super easy to flatten them back. With out. like Yu-Gi-Oh, that we always had hollows, so yeah, some of the, the best cards will. Stuff, yeah, yeah. And that LOB, my first Ed packs, like they're all like warped like that. Oh no. And like you can like kind of flatten them out, but it's just kind of a lot of extra effort. Um, two cards left. Yeah, these are our uncommon slash rares. So, so it could be either. This is the big money here. Hmm. We've been we've been trolled, maybe. Wait. It happens. What? <laughs> it happens. So was, what happened here? I think we just got trolled. It's okay. Let's see what this is. Okay. Draft is right. So we get the wrong order? We might have the wrong order. Maybe we got the wrong order because we got two. We get two. How often do you get two of the same commons? Not very often. I think we just had the wrong order. I might have had it backwards. The, Interesting. We may, we may have started off with the... Uh, we'll double check this and make sure... Yeah, we're, we're, we're going to double check for next time. Confusion has happened. I'm pumped about this next pack. Last two we have. We've opened a lot of magic today, and it has yeah. been a blast. And I want to end it on something crazy. We've had a Let's couple of big pulls today, so... Let's do it. Let's see if this Legends pack right here this last one we have 15 cards let's see what we can get we got to be nice and careful there is a little uh little booklet so we're covered on this we don't have to worry about yeah. getting spoiled we did figure out the antiquities thing yeah, so I, I had it backwards guys sue me you know my bad uh, yeah you had it backwards it's okay that's fine we were a little confused but expensive cards this time so we didn't spoiler the good stuff yeah imagine if we had just pulled like a crazy card oh that was gonna be perfect that little spot at the end dang it still pretty good opening whoa okay whoa almost spoiled it I think I might know what that is, and we no. might have hit something huge. <laughs> no, 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 you don't know anything. Yeah, we gotta ship anything to these ones. It's legends. The, the oh, right, right, right. Man. Okay, yeah, there's nothing. There's nothing here. We didn't spoil anything. We might have hit something. <laughs> I got too busy thinking about preserving the pack, and I might have spoiled it. <laughs> I didn't see it, though, so I'm not spoiled yet, so I will get pumped with whatever it is. Zephyr Falcon. Not Very a beautiful. Stormcrow, but... Oh, yeah, you know, I'll bird. let you... Uh, 
Oh yeah, I gotta sleep. Save that bad boy too. up there. It's barely four dollars, <laughs> so that's worth it. Vampire bats. Okay, we're still looking for those same guys we got last time. Let's see if we can do it. Looking for the chain lightning and darkness. Yeah. Uh, kobolds are also worth a few bucks in here too. Okay, just go ahead and some, mention that so we can pull some, it. Some random, some random kobolds would be also pretty fire. Barbary apes. Gotta get the mankeys. We have the boot. That is a stonk looking dude. He is a little bit dude, swole. If I, was, if I was that Jack, I would just walk around on the beach all the time. Yeah, I'd be like, <laughs> okay, I don't need to do anything else. I am. Um, Zephyr Falcon. I think we got that last time. Those. Or do we just pull it in this we pack? Just pull it in this pack. <laughs> Getting doubles, the, man. The common collation is a little interesting sometimes in Legends. Virgin okay. of the Holy Nimbus. Is that Nimbus? Yeah, okay, I can't see the middle of the end there. Come on, baby. Fire Spirits. Not a bad art. Another it's nice one. Art. We have a... Hey, oh! There we go! There's a uh, kobold! Look at this guy! Oh! Four, four bucks. That's sick! Another nice common. I actually got hit up by a guy who was like, dude, I just want all your near-mint kobolds from PAX. Like, <laughs> dude just buys kobolds. I'm like, this is awesome. That's incredible. Okay, I think we might be in uncommons now. Uh, we got, I think, two more. Okay. That's, so one more after that, I think. One more. Okay, never mind. We just so. more, more cards here than I thought. Yep. Okay. That should be a common... Hammerheim? Oh, we're uncommons now. That looks like a great card. I'm guessing it's not, but... No, that's, a, that's an uncommon. This is okay. a good hit. This is a good hit. Okay, and yeah. That's actually pretty well centered. It just looks like a good card. I don't know if it is, but... <laughs> All right, we got might, two more uncommons. Here we go, agree. baby. Ooh, Torsten von Ursus. That's a good uncommon. Okay, we're kind of crushing so our, right now. Our uncommons are pretty solid. Legends is, like, apparently my set, so... Yeah, right? That's nice. Well, alliances, too. Okay, one more. Sylvan Paradise. That's a nice card. That's there's good. a there's a there's a slight art factor on this one why uh yeah i i, I noticed a, i noticed why it's appealing i chose not to mention it okay one more card all right let's see if we can get something crazy here a little bit of edgeware on that corner right there here we go last card of our legends opening Ooh, that is big greed greed is big greed. so this in a this in a nine five quad is like a twelve hundred dollar card whoa yeah so that's like a big the, the one. Rated premium on this is crazy. Greed. High. All right. That is sick. He looks. Uh, what's up? What's his name? Scrooge McDuck over there, chilling with the stuff. So that turned out to be a pretty crazy pack, actually. No, this is a good pack. And this Both was... of our legends have been pretty nice. I think it was that corner on the top left was the only yeah. thing I saw. But yeah, I saw the I saw the Sylvan Paradise. I saw the green. And I thought it was Eureka, and I was like, oh I saw, snap! I, I saw the green too, oh, and I was snap. like, oh. <laughs> Okay, I didn't quite spoil it, but it would have been better if I had actually spoiled it and it was that. That, that would have been good. Be but booster pack, eight tradable cards, stand it off. We did we did figure out the orientation now. We're not going to be spoiling anything. So we can just open it straight up and not yeah, worry about it because it is common. Yeah, yeah, we figured out because last uh, time it got a little confusing about where it was. Okay, we're going to be very careful. I'm glad I don't have to worry about spoiling anything this time. Yep, there's a nice. That's a definitely a common, so we're definitely on the right track here. This opened. I'm going to get this the perfect opening right here. Oh, it's that bottom <laughs> part every time, man. Yep, it's, it's always a little bit. Just oh, little bit so hard. Okay. <laughs> Artifact Ward. Eight cards coming up, guys. We got our common. Another one of these. It's three <laughs> and two packs. Yep. This thing just wants to show up, man. This we is got, insane. We've got a whole place, though. We're making games. Man. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Oh, my goodness. Is that Gengar? Tall. That's Gengar, all right. That's what's all. <laughs> That's the original Gengar. That's the OG Gengar. Oh my gosh, we have the uh, clay statue. Okay. All right, beautiful card. Let's see if we can get some awesome. All right, the Gremlins. Gremlins is not bad. It looks like a drum set. All right. Like in the mood, he's like in the outside. <laughs> okay. Grape shot catapults. I actually, we haven't actually pulled that yet. Okay, it's a new one. So, it's just a common you haven't pulled yet. Yeah, it's a nice. random common you haven't pulled. So now we hit an uncommon here. Ooh, Coral Ooh. Helm is decent. Coral Helm, okay, it's decent. It's a few dollars, a few decent. dollars. It's leading up to the big one. All right, let's, let's go. see what we got. Let's see what we got. Uh, Did we already pull that guy? <laughs> <laughs> we keep pulling the we got, same cards. We got trolled on antiquities. I think antiquities is not my set. I think that's yeah, what we, we figured got, out. We got yeah. trolled on antiquities. Legends is my set. Legends is definitely your set. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that was super fun, and I wanted to shout out Magic Demillions and Rich. Thank you so much for allowing me to be a part of these awesome openings. It was super fun and super amazing. So go check out his YouTube channel. He has one. They open this vintage stuff quite a bit. So make sure you guys go check that out. Give him a sub. I think he's pretty close to a thousand. So go follow.
follow him over there if you guys like magic. And I'll see you guys in the next video, which will probably be Yu-Gi-Oh! So, see you guys again. Shout out to Tone Fo Show, Puffin Zudum, Ernesto Dan, America Deutscher, KK Beats, Another Side Show, Ian Moose, Junior Barning, Robert F., Thomas McLean, Chang Lang, and Aldelso Galicia Jr. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.